Hey there guys, it's Kason here and today what we're going to be doing is a beginner's guide to redstone. So one of the things we're going to be showing you today uh, is we're going to show you how to make this double piston door which is nice and simple as you can see behind me. Doesn't take a lot of materials, you need, you're going to need two redstone lamps, two repeaters, four pressure plates, some glass, some sticky pistons and we're going to show you how to build this thing. And then we're also going to show you how to extend it upwards. So if you want to make it bigger, so we just come over here like uh, this. Come over here. We'll show you how to make this as well. All right? So yeah, we're going to show you how to do the double piston door. If you want to know how to make a double piston door, then we're also going to show you how to make a lovely giant piston door, if you want to call it that. Anyway, we'll see you on the video. Okay, so first thing you want to do is establish where you want to build your door. So we're going to do it here. Nice and simple. Now, you go two down. Boop, boop. Put some redstone here. So you're underneath the uh, pressure plates. So nice and simple. And on this side, you want to go two down again. Boop. And you go one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's coming through. So you've got your redstone directly underneath your pressure plates. As you can see, it fires as we go over. So next, you want to just clear out this section here. So we'll just put it like a so. So the glass is going to go there. So go back and go in the same length. Now, obviously, there are ways to improve the redstone we're going to be using, but that's fine for today. So, first thing we're going to do is put down our sticky piston, sticky piston. Now, we're going to show you how to do the double, and then we're going to show you how to do the repeater. So, sticky piston, sticky piston, boom, boom. It's in the wrong spot, Kason. Come on, mate. You can do better than that. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Right? Nice and simple. As you can see, it's already coming along. So, you want to... Break this, break this, break this, put your repeater facing the brick. Break this, break this, break this, repeater facing the brick. Redstone, uh, you're going to put a redstone torch here. You're going to put a redstone line running here, redstone line running here. And you're going to put a redstone torch here. Now, to make these doors fire, you just need a block on top of it. As you can see, a signal block, if you would. Put a redstone touch on top. Redstone touch on top. And we'll just do this for effect. And now look, whoop, our doors work. All right, so that's how to make the double piston doors. Hopefully, you guys followed that and it was pretty easy to, it was pretty straightforward and to the point. And you guys could see how easy the redstone was to set up. All right, so we'll be right back to show you how to extend this upwards if you want to make it bigger. So if you want to make it the big one, we'll show you how to do that. All right, guys, we're back, and we're going to show you how to extend this up. Now, the easy way to do this, uh, so you can place your slabs, right, is we've over, we've got the wall set up. So, what you're going to need to do, I'm just going to put that there like that. So, you put your first slab here, then you want to go two and a half up, so your next slab's here, and you want to go two and a half up, so your next slab's there, right? Very simple. So, you do that, you do that. Then on this side, you want to go one and a half up, one and a half up, and that's it. That's basically your current now, just to carry your redstone up. So, as you can see, your redstone connects. Because it's half slabs, it just easily flows up. So, as you can see, nice and simple. You see the pistons are firing. Oh, we forgot to put glass on the pistons, that's fine. We well, can put glass on the pistons now. Right, so nice and simple. Very simple to, very simple to do. Just cover this up. And on this side, you do the same thing. So you break a hole here to continue the circuit through, as you can see, boop. Then on here, you wanna go one, two. I think I've already gotten. Uh, you wanna do one, and you wanna do two. Now this obviously repeats up. You can use observers here, because um, obviously observers will work in the place of Thing, but it's, it's the same thing really so the observer facing down I said facing down observer so all right observer facing down and you can have an observer I think you, we'll test it with the observer all right so as you can see that fires four piston doors open and that's with the observer just instead of having that block it does the same thing really it reads the redstone signal now you go through, boom. 
card doesn't retract with the observer. All right, so that's fine. We take the observer, observer away. You guys can let me know in the comment section down below what I'm doing wrong now, and that's fine. So you repeat there, boom, nice and easy. And then you just close it up. And now obviously you can use whatever block you want. I'm just using the wall just to show you guys how this is done. And yeah, let me know if you liked this double piston door idea and if you like the circuitry to extend it. Because you can make it as big as you want. Now I haven't tested this with honeycomb with uh, honey blocks because the chances are you could actually make your door bigger and have uh, a bigger glass door but that's stuff for another day anyway guys if you like the video you know what to do by now blast the thumbs up button for me uh, subscribe to the channel if you thought this tutorial was helpful uh, and let us know in the down there below if you enjoyed this tutorial and as ever i've been casing you guys have been amazing have a great and wonderful day and let me know your feedback and your improvements in the comments below I'll see you later guys, bye.